Hello everybody, I'm Storm here, and welcome back to Crusader Kings 2 After the End. In the last episode, we were working on getting our empire managed, and then we came down with a very severe flu. It uh, basically left us bedridden, so we were under a regency for a while and really couldn't do much. Um, so, our well, threat's down to 88%. Uh, we also, right at the end of the episode, uh, something fired that gave us the depressed trait, which allows us to commit suicide, um, so that we can go through succession. And I was looking at this, and our, you know, our granddaughter isn't quite married yet. I, th I think I want to go through succession. Um, it's going to cause a little bit of trouble because declare uh, committing suicide is going to in is going to give you a or give me a negative fifty general opinion, and then that puts a malice on the successor about the um, opinion of the predecessor, um, as far as vassal opinion goes, but. Um, it only la it's only going to last for a year. I, I took a look at it. Uh, that will only last for a year. You know, that's the same time the council's going to be discontent. A year goes by in this game really quick. So, I'm not that worried about art. We have an enormous supply of prestige. So, you know, who cares? So, we are going to go ahead and do it. Alright, so... Yep, Empress Willow feasts with the gods at age 64. She committed suicide, known to be kind. Few had a bad word to say about her. A godly woman. Willa is with the machine spirits now. Alright, so... We got a bit of management to do here. Um... Because yeah, we look at our vassal opinions, they're not that great. And a lot of it has to do with the fact that we're getting a negative opinion of predecessor. So, like, some of these guys have really high opinion of predecessor negatives. Um, which is only going to last, again, as I said, for a year. Now, we also have an issue. We are over demand size. We are over vassal limit. Because, apparently... Uh, Eric here was the Viceroy of Michigan and actually holds some territory here. So if you look at direct vassals, currently holds Lansing. So we don't necessarily want that anymore. So we want to give it to the du jour duchy. We want to give it to this guy. So this guy, he Desires the oligarchy of mid-Michigan. So we're going to go ahead, we're going to grant him the land of title. We're going to say all lower titles, mid-Michigan. Send it. So there we go. So we got rid of that. Now we also apparently hold the West Michigan Duchy as well. Which is this guy here. Which if we look at this, is going to be like... You? Yeah, you. So we grant him the land of title. Of West Michigan. And get rid of that. You like us a lot, so we're going to have to grant you the vice royalty of Michigan itself. Send that off. So there, we're good. And does he have any... Counts to transfer? No. We have an open council position. We need to assign a spy master. So hire this guy as spy master. He doesn't like us at the moment, which is not good. But let's throw some money at him. Uh, let's see. Send him a gift. Four hundred. Yeah, it's fine. Okay, we have some tech we need to invest in. Okay, we'll grab that. Special title actions, set crown focus. We want to set it 
there. Do it. We need to point a designate. We need a designator regent, which is going to be you, Governor Louisiana. Who really liked our our mother. Right, so court eunuch. Ooh, we actually have a eunuch. We can appoint. Daniel Krug. Master Bo. Go with you. Any commander? There we are. Okay. Now, we're going to be paused for a bit at the beginning of the game here because of that succession. Um, we are still in issue with the men's size. Because our stewardship is not good, and our wife's stewardship is not good enough, even though she's a genius. Oh. She has cancer. Well, that's not good. Uh, that's not good at all. But we have children, so it's okay. And you know, our daughter is betrothed. Is there anything else we need to do? I think I think we can just go ahead and unpause. It. I don't want to roll it that fast. Um, yeah, I like money. We're gonna take the banker trait. Uh, our bequeathment. Let's see, what is this? Pre-Calamity Antique Typewriter. Yep, we're gonna get it. Governor Vincennes' request is permission to use a training ground, of course. Um, we are gonna share the knowledge, indeed. Bequeathment. We got... Pre-Calamity Pocket Watch. Oh, we have ambition. Um, oh, we are having a plot. Cancel the plot. And we are set to business focus already, so uh, I guess we'll keep that. See the round prosper. Uh, pre calamity mechanical calculator. Yep, got it. Oh, we got a dangerous faction. Increase council power faction. Hmm. We can't use the council to mitigate that at the moment because it's discontent. It's going to be discontent for two years. Our pre calamity textbooks. Yep, got that. Antique firearm. Yes. I've been using it since I was young. Pre calamity blast telescope. Alright. Uh, let's see. Do we want to. Gain two learning. Okay, so let's gain the two learning and lose the fertility. We already have kids. We don't really need to worry about that right now. Oh, we have some additional retinue. I'll take that. Move over there. Castle is fitted with hidden trap doors and passages. Gain some intrigue. All right. One thing we do want to do is just go through here and check our holdings. Alright, we gained some diplomacy from our garden. And we made some money. Or we actually, we, we did not make any money. We broke even as a banker already. Right, barracks, build that up. Oh, this is that new city we built. Okay, yep. Get some city walls. Station Master Aldrost feels I risk too much with my escapades and tried to persuade me to stop risking my life. Ah, uh, whatever. Alright, let's go through all here and make sure that everything gets, gets up to where we want it. That's, that's not what I want to do. Improve the church. The cathedral. Uh, this is Columbus. This is Akron. Now we gain a stewardship. 
Still not enough to flip it over to seven. Demand size. Barracks, improve that. There we go. Two titles can be usurped. Ooh, we can usurp the Kingdom of the Maritimes. Indeed, usurp it. Very good. If my vassals gave it to me, I will go ahead and take it. All right, let's take a look at my... Here, let's give this to this guy. Grant Vice Royalty, Tycoonship of the Maritimes. Send it. And let's transfer the neighboring counts. Do it. Is this me? No, that's not me. Okay, that actually did improve our vassal limit a little bit. Get rid of some of those vassals. Not everyone has a hedge mage in their garden, or a hedge maze in their garden. It will certainly impress guests as long as you make sure they find their way out of it. Indeed, we gain some diplomacy. Uh, diplomacy is good because that improves everybody's opinion of me in general. Yeah, see, it's already June. As soon as it hits October again, that that malice is going to drop off, and uh, oh, some more diplomacy. And then we. Uh, that will improve things quite a bit. Trade route from Cayuga is in dire need of a new ship. Yeah, buy the ship. We got plenty of money. We got an enormous amount of money coming into our coffers as well. And then as we improve this, that's going to help. Ooh, Petrolith can marry. Our daughter, yes. of Bentley and Princess Erica are getting married. I will take the money. Because our guy is greedy, so he's definitely going to want the money. Uh, what duchy is this? I didn't even look at his stats. Okay, so... I just noticed that it said it was greedy from when we took Banker. Um, frail, he's scarred, he's Banker, he got all the pre-calamity stuff. He is greedy, he's diligent, he's gregarious, he's trusting, and he's brave. Reduc uh, rejecting seduction attempts. He's elusive shadow. That's hurting our stewardship a little bit. So what is this? Um, this one. I'm sure it's usurp it. And I guess we'll give it out to this guy. Sure. I think that, yeah, that is my governor. So that improves his opinion quite a bit. Good. Court physician. Scholarly theologian. Dutiful cleric. Yeah, we'll take that guy. Collected a tithe, good. Council's gonna be discontent. Alright, fifth, let's see, I think. And please report to success my mission. Good. Look at the council. Positions. Is there a vassal here who's of high rank who doesn't like me a lot? Um, like, leader of the Alleghenite revolt? I'm not worried about the revolt. 
Dixielander Revolt, Magnolian Revolt, Vicerine of Gotham. Uh, let's do that. Where is Vicerine of Gotham? There you are. So let's have you improve relations over there. Merge. Prince Virgil, the usurper, has defaulted on his debt. But I can't really do anything about it. Alright, so yeah. That negative opinion should be gone. Yep, it's gone. So now that means that opinion should be much better. And it is. Of our big loans went sour, we lost a lot of gold. Let's see. My cousin. Territory of New England. Sure. Loyal servants are designed to truly deserve some recognition and rewards from time to time. No, we're not going to grant them any titles. Okay, so, let's take a look at this. Let's see, can we adjust some laws? Ah! We managed to get enough stewardship to get our demand size up, so I don't need to worry about that. Let's see if we can remove another council power. Ooh, Malcolm of Anabaptist Uprising declare fourth American Anabaptist Revolt. Uh, and the Consumerist Uprising. All right, so these are the Anabaptists. 12,000. Uh, what are we looking at? Do you have a significant levy? Uh, 3,000. Um, what about you, 16,000? Actually, let's, let's disband you guys. Let's raise you here. I'll raise this army here. Actually, we don't need this. This should be more than enough. Oh, we got the other revolt we need to worry about. Just down here. Magnolia, 9,000. Ah, I cannot raise... Let's do this then. We'll raise your army. We'll raise your army. And is there anybody else we can raise? Yeah, that'll work. Get everybody down here. Now, as I was saying, uh, let's remove one of these laws. So, we need Machinist Roger of Barberton is already in favor. So, we just need three more guys. So, we just need three more guys. Who was it who was in favor? Roger of Barberton. Victor, Zachary, Vincennes, Robert the Troubadour. Okay, with Chancellor. Okay, he already, he's a loyalist. Can we buy a favor? Yes. Can we buy a favor from you? Yes. Can we buy a favor from you? No. What about from you? Yes. Okay. So we'll buy some favors. There we go. We'll call in council support. We'll call in council support. We'll call in council. Well, not you. 
you. Call in council support. Okay, and then we will go ahead and hit this. Oh, hold on. Yep, hit that. Good. Perfect. You guys merge. My son. He's playful, conscientious, and an idolizer. Conscientious. Let's go ahead and get him some stewardship. Let's do that. Alright, so you guys merge. Let's wait for the... Um... Oh, hold on a moment. Council must be content. Okay, so we don't have a content council yet. We need to get through another year. Oh, these guys are good. We'll march in there, and then we'll march you guys in there. We'll deal with both of these revolts. Holly the Cruel is your serpent title. My kinsman, I don't really care. He's, a, he's affectionate. Idolize are haughty. Uh, diplomat. All right. Offer peace. Enforce demands. Throw them away. Send you guys home. These guys get away. Those guys got away. This is a weird thing where you get the victory message twice. I've been noticing. Force demands. Yes. Hold a salvage expedition. A grand tournament. One thing I wonder. Declare war. Holy war. Holy war. Doesn't seem to want to let me do a great holy war. We still have this dangerous increasing council power, but that should hopefully go away when the, when the council is content again. Default on almost debt. Alright, when can we adjust those laws again? Five years. Alright. All right, he is quick. She's betrothed. A dirty secret. Just, a, just the other day, skulking as I often do, I caught oligarch Edmund of Sowega and my courtier Theodore doing what man should not do to man. He didn't notice me, but I am still in shock. Oh, so he apparently he's a homosexual. Um, the flesh is weak, forgive and forget. Unholy sinners, they must be exposed. Why do we have black... These guys are, like... Of no consequence. Yeah, I don't, I don't really care. Go about your business. None of mine. Alright, the council is now content, and as I suspected, the increased council power faction has been uh, rendered irrelevant. Master Governor Zachary of Hudsonia is concerned about his non-inheriting sons. No, I'm not giving you any land. 
Okay, what's the threat at? 82.6. Okay, well... What's our military situation? 278,000 troops. We shouldn't have any truces, so we could go to war with anybody we want. Go to war with anybody we want. We need to get... Well, he's dealing with a Catholic uprising. I'm not worried about a Catholic uprising, but I do want to get some of this territory. I need to get, I need to get all of this, really. All right, Manitoba, Manitoba. We declare war on you. We can do a debt war. Well, everybody would join in, and I really wouldn't get anything out of it, so I'm not worried about the debt war. Um. Moin Holdings. No, I'm not worried about that at the moment. Just a... A single... it just be for this bishopric. I'm not worried about a bishopric. Uh, declare war. Let's say... Holy War for Boonslick. Councils in favor. Yeah, go ahead and send it. All right, let's raise the troops. guys all gather bring you to Detroit oh, 75,000 troops in Detroit that's pretty nice expand that you guys are just gonna die 40,000 Keep these, those guys there. Let's see. 4,000. Let's take all these guys and march them there. Now we need to get more troops towards the war goal. Gather there. These guys gather here. Grab all of these guys and gather them there as well. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. There we go. And then we'll get these guys. And we'll move them into the region as well. Uh, you, you, and you, he said. Get over here. And 10,000 troops, we'll march them over here, then we'll see where we're going to put everybody. Alright. Here comes everybody. Oh, these guys are not moving. Neither are those guys. Um, let's head over there. After 100 years under the Neo-American Empire, the territory of Allegheny is now considered part of it. De jure empires... Yep, our de jure territory is growing pretty well. Defeat. Uh... what?
lost control of Clearwater in Tampa. Kingdom of Cuba managed to siege that? Alright. Well. Let's change plans. Let's bring these guys down here. Victory. Go, go. We need to get somebody in the war goal. Defeat. You guys merge up. You guys merge up. Should probably keep these guys in the area in case Ontario's army shows up in force. Uh, let's get... 3,000, 4,000, 30,000. Those guys up there, these guys, bring them down here. Yeah, Commander. Alright, hold the phone. Can I get this army dealt with? Can you get in here? Victory. Alright, so you... Merge up and get in the war goal. You guys merge up. We got more reinforcements coming in. Okay, that's good. Defeat. Twenty thousand troops. Get in there. Oh, we got eleven thousand troops coming in. Victory, victory. A sudden shooting pain strikes your chest and a moment of agony of passes for now. We're having chest pains. Lovely. Station Master Christoph of El Rira educated guesses that you are in the early stages of gout and he insists you follow his instructions. Right. Jim was captured in battle and is now my prisoner. Perfect. Station Master Christoph spent many hours studying the stars before informing you that in order for your strength to return, you had to fast for the better half of a fortnight. Well, actually, that might help the gout. Alright, so. Here we go. Apparently they tried to attack me and failed. Fine by me. Alright, this is back in my hands. Get you guys over there. We're taking attrition. March over there. Guys, let's merge you up and march you in there. Let's actually march them out for the time being. Let's bring them in the coal. And we're actually out of time here. So we'll end this here and then we'll finish uh, prosecuting this war when we come back. So, hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment. 
and I will see you next time.